doing okay? Oh yeah, just still getting set up here. You know, because I'm on the lag wagon, just like my shirt says. <laughs> oh. Dude, so a crazy day today. I mean, if I'm sure you, some of you guys have already heard here on the East Coast that a lot of us are under a tsunami warning right now. Um, there was a magnitude 7.5 earthquake off the coast of Alaska today, so who knows? This could be the beginning that we just start rocking off into the ocean. <laughs> no, I got the alert on my phone. That's That was crazy, dude. Well, I'm actually kind of used to the um, the alerts that I get for like a Amber Alert or something like that. But, you know, a tsunami warning. <laughs> well, I also um, um, weather channel, you know, and I go like major news. So, yeah, yeah. So I also have found out that um, I am not the multi-streamer. Yeah, I cannot multi-stream to save my life. <laughs> well, yesterday I was trying to do Andazan and SEAL Team 7-Eleven a solid by, you know, trying to stream theirs on, you know, because they do YouTube, so I was trying to stream them on Twitch. Well, my dumbass doesn't know how to multi-stream, and I have the volume all the way down during, like, 90% of Trump's freaking um, uh, rally in Carson City. So, hi, executive. Hi, CD. Good to see you. But yes, I got my first piece of mail in my new P.O. box today. Yay! So I'll get to that in just a second. First off, let's do a dab because, yeah. It's been a day, people. It's been a day. Um, got the last car out of the shop today, so, you know, it's a little bit of a heartbreaker, but also a big, oh, thank God that's over. <laughs> but now we're getting the dab time ready to go. And then, uh, I'll show you my mail I got. Ah, but how's everybody's Monday going? Hopefully it's better. Seems like everybody's having a Monday today. Kinda sucks, I'm sorry. If you're having a Monday, I am so sorry. I want you to have a day. Have a day. Yeah, I say have a day because if you just say, you know, have a good day, that sets an expectation. Um, this way, you just have a day. Just have a day. That's all I can say, just have a day. As my hair goes flying out like that. All right, let's get to this dab, peoples. <gasps> no. No. Did I forget a lighter? Hang on. Our dog's here. I'm going to go grab his lighter real quick. I'll be right back. to get the lighter <laughs> no I forgot my lighter so I had to go grab it from our dog so dabs up love you guys to a Monday that it's freaking over <laughs> gotta make sure no one's watching our dogs back there but he don't care now give me just one second we finish this real quick and then I'll get to my mail Just burnt my hand. Ow. All right, all right. Let me go get the lighter back to our dog. I'll be right back. I know, I failed. <laughs> Bless me. All right, so, sorry. Okay, so I'm back. My piece of mail that I got today, my first piece of mail for my streaming address, which y'all know, type in exclamation mark uh, address and it should come up. So, my first piece of mail, you ready for this? It's from the postal service. <laughs> yeah, pretty much just saying uh, make sure, hi, welcome. But if you can read that, that one word girl, P.O. Box 2365. <laughs> Sacramento, California. And I know it kind of got a little smooshed, but that does say 95812. 
Hmm. So I actually got to make sure I have that correct because I thought it was one four. Oops. Hmm. Anyway. So yeah, if you're in on the Oregon coast, Washington coast, California coast, get ready for a tsunami, and it'll probably be like that big. I've been I've been through a tsunami before. It was actually measured at three inches. How the fuck do you guys measure three inches for a tsunami, huh? Just asking. Just asking. <laughs> yep, got the claw back. Got the claw. No cigarettes. Although I was smoking a few yesterday, but I have not had one today. I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> oh. oh, you did? <laughs> mm. How you doing, Mr. Neo Trip? Good to see you, baby. Thanks for joining us. Now, it, it, we're just chilling out again. Um, I might do some gaming, because today, I guess, te technically, is mostly gaming Mondays. I don't know. And Azant came up with it. I ran with it. <laughs> like, tomorrow is another day, which I don't remember what it is now. Oh, no. I am so sorry, honey. Oh, God, ow, ow. Both ends? Oh, the rotis, was it like uh, from the supermarket, the $5 chickens that, like at Costco or whatever grocery store? See, yeah. I always try and put those in the oven for like another 20 minutes. I mean, seriously. Uh, I mean, I, I like them because they're quick, easy, but put them in the oven for another 20 minutes just to be on the safe side. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. That sucks. I'm sorry. Hmm. God. Now, I haven't had food poisoning in a while. Well, actually, since COVID hit. <laughs> no, it, it's just... Oh, that sucks, dude. Well, I had it from sushi. Yeah. I should not have even have eaten in there because I like to... When I go to a sushi restaurant, I like to sit right up there at the sushi bar so I can watch them make it like the plexiglass that's normally around the sushi there was like corner gunk and shit yeah it was disgusting and I shouldn't have eaten there but I did and Mr. Neo Trip dear my dear god bless ya oh my god that sucks dude Ugh. slancha salute salad Frost, Nostrovia, Skull, Kampai. Cheers. Prost. Did I already say Prost? Probably. I don't know. <laughs> uh, now, um, so yeah, the, oh, here comes Mr. Choo Choo Train. Here. That's how close I am to the railroad tracks. Yep. But see, now that I'm on 4G, I'm not dropping you guys now, huh? Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Come on her. Ah, ah. Boom. Aim into that one. Oh, there's so many of them, I can't remember them all. There's, um, uh... oh God, I can't even think. Yeah, um, but real quick, uh, I know it's been kind of back and forth. I've given you guys some information about the shop and this and that and this and that, but it is, uh, we are going to be closing. Um, it's going to be at least another two weeks before the city is going to be out there. That's what the city has told me today. Um, right now, I'm looking to move the shop over towards like Carmichael area, if you know uh, Sacramento. Um, Carmichael, Orange, um, Orangevale, that stuff over there. So possibly Rancho Cordova. So I'll be closer to some of you guys. Yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah, it fucking sucks. But you know, we do what we can. But um, my next thing, I'm looking at uh, gold pans. I'm going to start doing a gold panning stream. Went to the river last week and yeah, I got the gold fever now. So, um, if you know any gold pans, or if you're a gold panner, and you have any recommendations, let me know. Um, there's a couple just plastic ones I'm looking at, but I've heard the metal ones are better. So, if you know anything, 
Um, well, we're closing because we've had major plumbing issues. Um, I'll try and make this short. A couple weeks ago, we had, about four weeks ago, we had water coming up our urinal and into our shop. Plumbing company came out, uh, found out that there's not a proper city clean out. So there is a clean out in the shop. They tried to do us a solid and try and clean it out through that way. Got their hose stuck. <gasps> got it stuck in the alley on city property. So they had to do a really quick, you know, try and get it out. They got it stuck. So it was gonna cost our landlord about $8,000 to do it. They finally get the authorization. They dig into the freaking alleyway um, where the water meter is, where the city clean out should be start digging they notice the ground started just getting wetter and wetter and wetter I mean when they jackhammer they have a hose but they're noticing the ground is being more saturated they finally get in there find out oh shit from three years ago the city forgot to hook up the shit correctly not even just our property but other lines and now there's about a 10 foot cesspool sinkhole in the works under the alley and part of my property so now the city has to come out dig out everything but here's the kicker just when they get everything possibly hooked back up there is no guarantee that they're going to be able to hook our piping back up because it's old as fuck so yeah so yeah uh, plus the shop i sh i should not have gotten the shop when i did um at least leasing it from this guy um half the electrical didn't work and i went into knowing that i did not know about how shoddy the roof was so i've had to rearrange my office because anytime it rains i have water coming down the walls so i had to had had to move my printer computer all that fun stuff so yeah and this has been going on for three and a half four weeks now and the city told me that they're it'll be a miracle if they start before november so now, I am getting compensated by the city, but when am I gonna see it? I don't know. Um, the maximum is $25,000. Um, and you think about it, that is quite a bit of money. It really is. Um, and the uh, landlord also gets compensated as well. What he gets, I think, is just primarily um, just rent coverage. But since we're the business, we get you know, compensation from the city for that. But again, how long is it gonna be before I see that? I have no idea. So, it's, I, I just can't hang on that long. I, I just can't. Um, so I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying to get a hold of the landlord, um, but of course the landlord's in fucking Texas. That should have been my other clue. The landlord is from out of state, okay? So that's my other problem. Um, what I'm going to try and have him do is pretty much give me free rent until the end of the year until I can get my shit out of there. Um, I mean, that's the fucking least he can do. So um, I'm going to do that and see if I can't find something else. Now, again, what I'm trying to kind of look for is a mixed use um, warehouse where I can build an apartment or there's already an apartment set up and I have a shop in the back. But you know what, I might just have to do like everybody else and just get a normal job, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. But yeah, so it, it's been a Monday, it's been a Monday. Oh, also, the Orion Meteor Shower, if you get a chance, um, coming out of the southeast, bet actually between southeast and uh, east, there is going to be a meteor shower tonight, so. Be on the lookout for that if you get a chance. About 20 meteors an hour. So, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. But no, I, I that was fun watching Anda Zant and SEAL Team 7-Eleven yesterday, uh, Sergeant Sergio. They went down to uh, Carson City, Nevada to the Trump rally. Hung out in Reno. Never did see a Reno uh, stream, so I wonder if they got in trouble. <laughs> Hi, Jason. Hi, sweetie. How you doing? Oh, you want to see the piece of mail I got? My first piece of mail? Look at this. It's from the Postal Service. <laughs> yeah, no, it's their welcome letter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is just funny. Yeah, so that's my first piece of mail I've gotten in my... In my winning! Hey, Jason, can you do me a solid, just type in hashtag address so my address comes up. Thank you. 
so yeah, I, I was like, man, I have, since I opened it, I haven't been in there yet. So I figured to go check it out, and this was the only thing in there, so. I'm like, ah! People, you've asked me to get a P.O. box so you can send me stuff. So I spent 30, well, actually, somebody spent $30, you know, donated it to me, and got it. Now nobody's sending me stuff. What the hell? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I'm giving you guys shit. Giving you guys shit. But yeah, there has been some more protests actually going on down here in Sacramento. Of course, all BLM, Antifa, Black Zebra Productions. So not like really anything major. Oh shit, oh shit. Wow. Yeah. No, I, I know, because, uh, and this one's like downtown at, um, actually it's right next door to the um, the Golden One Center where the Sacramento basketball team plays. Um, yeah, so for 30 bucks now, it's literally, it's the size like this deep and like this wide. I mean, it's like that deep, enough for a letter, postcard. Um, but they'll hold the packages and stuff. Now, if I wanted to go to the one that's like over in the suburbs, literally the same amount of distance, it was almost 40 bucks. I was like, that doesn't make sense. All right, whatever. Mm, I don't know. But hey, to a Monday, right? To a fucking Monday. Yeah, I could use some white cloth stuff. Actually, I could use some hoodies. Well, I'm. if you get me a medium, I am like the coolest chick to buy like shirts and hoodies for, size medium. Oh damn. Damn! A hundred bucks? Whoa! That's a lot, dude. That's insane. Well, of course, I don't, you know, New Zealand, I don't know what the, yeah, it'd be a, oh shit, dude. Was that for three months or just one month? Because I could understand being a couple months, but that's a month? Holy crap. Oh, for a year? Oh! Okay, no, then that's hella cheap. No, mine is 30 bucks, it's $10 a month, so it's 120 bucks a year, so mine's 20 bucks more. Jason, I'm moving, baby. I'm gonna move to you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so actually it works out to be about the same. You know, 20 bucks, give or take, you know. Yeah. But see, again, then saying that, you know, I'm not gonna spend the extra five bucks a month to have it down the street. I mean, the parking is easier, because this one that I go to, it's right on the street, so you have to like find city parking. So, yeah, they'll get you. Yeah, so I paid a buck seventy-five to grab my my post office freaking postcard. Go figure. <laughs> you were only getting seeds sent to you. Yeah, but how much were you selling those seeds for? Yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry, clones. <laughs> or were you or were you growing the mushrooms? Oh, breeding. Ah. Ah. Yeah, I know you guys are, I know a lot of you guys don't like my mohawk, so I am actually trying to be thoughtful. See there, cover it over the ears, nobody knows. <laughs> and then I do this. And then you can kind of see where I don't have little sideburns, you know, the little pimple hair, but that's okay. I'm just pissed. I forgot a freaking lighter. Our dog already left. Damn it. Oh, no. Oh, he's still over there. I might have to go grab his uh, lighter. Um, I was going to say something I can't remember. I don't remember. I don't know. Could have been all that important. I don't think so. Here, let me go get a lighter from our dog real quick and we're gonna do it one more bowl, okay? Hang on. Mm. 
Now I actually have a tank top on underneath. Now I um yeah, I'll talk about that here in just a minute. So real quick, dab time guys. Dab time. Hmm. <laughs> here wait wait. Let's get it on. Hello, this is Tatiana with Women's March Across. Whatever. Oh, it was just a little notification I got, so whatever. Dabs, F Monday. <sighs> That's the stuff. Yeah. Hang on, one more. I had to borrow the lighter, so I'm not gonna fucking hog it. Plus, there's somebody coming. Oh god, this thing is so plugged, it's ridiculous! Oh yeah, I get a bunch of lurkers that come in here. Yep, yep, she's on. Bye. Here, I'll be right back. When's the last time you've seen an adult girl skip? <laughs> yeah, it's a stone. I actually got it in um, Oregon. Last year I went up 101, Highway 1, up to Coos Bay, Oregon. And that was at the dispensary and like one of those dispensaries in the first town you get in Oregon. And I was just gonna get like a couple joints, you know, nothing spectacular. And I had my glass piece with me, but I'm like, man. I've already dropped it once and the fact I didn't break it was amazing and enough. <laughs> um, and bought him for 20 bucks. Bought Rocco for 20 bucks. Yeah. See? There's no carb on it. No carb. But it gets plugged very easily. You definitely need a screen in it. Um, but yeah, it was 20 bucks. And if you're heading into Oregon, it's like the last dispensary on your right in like a strip mall. But yeah, it was cool. Chill them? Um, no, I have it. I've heard, I've heard of that. No, I've heard of that. It, that's the one. Where, yeah, it holds the ice cube. Is that the right one? I'm thinking. There's one that you actually have like an ice cube little holder. I don't know. Maybe that's the right one. I don't know. But that would be cool. No, I've had. Oh God, I, I've had the only, pretty much the only things I've never had was a volcano. Um. Yeah, that's pretty much the only thing I haven't had. <laughs> I mean, I've had some very intricate stuff that should have been not that expensive, but you know, when you're a stoner, you know. It's kind of like tools. When you're working on a car, you know, the tools do matter. I mean, Harbor Freight, if it lasts for one job, it did its job, okay? And plus, there's typically a lifetime warranty on the tools, so does it really fucking matter? <laughs> like a cone. Hmm. Well, I've seen the ones where you literally like put a chill dough. <laughs> you know, it's like a frozen icicle thing that you put in your water. But that's usually for uh, for pitchers of beer. <laughs> you know what? I know you guys are all over the world and everything. But here in California, I'm really missing the beer scene, man. Um, I, just, there's a couple dive bars here that I mean, they, there's no way they could conform to to COVID regulations. Um, but you know, where you pay, what is it, six bucks for a shot of Jameson, White Claw is like four bucks because it's White Claw. I mean, I just, I miss going to just a bar, hang out, see my buds, you know. Um, it, it sucks, it royally sucks. I mean, like going to Buffalo Wild Wings, it's odd enough having to sit on the patio, but, you know, and even as a smoker or former smoke, working on being a former smoker, I've never really liked sitting on patios unless I'm at the beach or, you know, it, or over a river or something like that. Yeah, pr well, they're, they're open um, and they do have it where the sidewalks are open or some of them have actually opened up their parking lots for it. So there are, there are, you know, bars open and restaurants open, but it's not, you can't eat inside. Some of them, 
they're starting to open up, but people are still so scared of everything right now that it's, it's kind of hard. Yeah. Um, no, but I need you guys to come up with an idea because for me to get to my next level of Twitch, I need to have 75 viewers at once. Yeah. And I don't know how I'm going to do that. I guess I should bring back the bikini, huh? I need to bring back the bikini. Well, if I level up in Twitch, then I get more money. <laughs> you have a suggestion, Jason? What is your suggestion, my dear? But you like the bikini idea. Okay. I'll just have to do that more. But it's so hard. Or is that half the appeal of me running around this apartment complex wearing a bikini trying to not give people freaking heart attacks? <laughs> right, right. I don't know. I know. I mean, but there's... We're actually starting to have some museums open up. But a lot of them are still kind of iffy about having people stream. I'm like, fine, I'll pay 20 bucks extra for you to just have me stream in your freaking museum, okay? I mean, not everybody can get out, so. Just saying. I mean, it's not like I'm asking shit for free, people. I mean, I, I fucking hate that. Hi, oh, y'all, yeah, I'm, an, I'm an influencer, and so can I get a free room or can I get a free meal? Because I have a thousand people that watch me. Yeah, and like 998 of them aren't from the area, so no, they're not going to give you shit for free. Now, will I bug people to give me subscriptions to other, other Twitter page? Yeah, I will. <laughs> but I'm trying to support somebody. <laughs> okay, so hiding in the stairwell. Okay. All right, that was actually kind of fun. <laughs> you know what? I who was that that was say and I misread it that night where they're like I'm just waiting for somebody to come out well he was meaning coming out and walking out the door and I misread that because the doors you can only open from the inside you can't open them from the outside so and I was like haha you're you're dumb because it only opens from the inside and I had to reread it but yeah I, I was kind of nervous because I had to hide a couple times because I heard the elevator move so I was like oh god oh god <laughs> uh, I didn't even put any eye makeup on today. Usually I have mascara and eyeliner. And yeah, I'm, I notice I'm looking a little extra wrinkly today. Oh, whoa, what the hell's that? No, I haven't been under stress. Can you tell? My vein is about ready to pop out of my freaking head. Good God. Anyway. Hmm. No, I'm okay. I'm okay. No worries. Sorry, I'm now like staring at my crow's feet. Oh, I'm 37. Eh, it's dry. Actually, yeah, that's not too bad. Just put some moisture on it. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Throw some oil on it. Yeah. <laughs> mm. I know I saw somebody trying to pedal. Got it. It was a... Chevy Caprice and they turned it into a 700 horsepower Chevy Caprice <laughs> like, <laughs> and I'm talking like 60s Caprice or maybe even early 70s Caprice if you know the Chevy Caprice of that era it's a fucking land yacht so you pushing 700 horsepower out of that fucker one it's only gonna feel like about 300 horsepower but two good god I don't know what the torque was but to me, that would be fucking scary. A 700 horsepower Chevy Caprice. Now, I don't know if it was convertible or not, but still, it don't matter. That'd be scary. Now, of course, seeing what they're doing with some of these newer diesel engines is insane. Oh yeah, for those of you just joining us, you wanna see the piece of mail I got? I know, I'm, I'm repeat. There it is. That was a piece of mail. The P.O. box you all wanted me to get so you guys can send me stuff. I get a piece, my first piece of mail in one week is from the Postal Service. <gasps> no stopping. Yeah, exactly. That was the other thing, Jason. I'm like, how the hell are you going to stop that sucker? I mean, you just go from light to light. You're going to have to pull a parachute or something or throw out an anchor. Okay, 
So people, I want you to look up like a 72 Chevy Caprice convertible especially. The sucker is a land yacht. I'm talking this sucker is like 20 feet long. Okay, if, no God, it's gotta be bigger than that. I'm gonna say it's almost 23 feet from bumper to bumper. It's fucking huge, people. It's fucking huge. So yeah, some dude has built a freaking 700 horsepower Caprice. And yeah, how the hell are you gonna stop that? Are you gonna throw the flaps open or something? No, it has to be a convertible. That way you throw the convertible top up to slow it down. <laughs> oh, I know. Yeah, I'm curious about Slugbug. What is he? I know. Wait, did he say he was gonna send me something? Oh yeah, he did. And he hasn't yet. <gasps> Slugbug, where are you, my dear? <laughs> yeah, popping all the knuckles. Dude. Yeah. Hey, I'm not smoking a cigarette, so give me that, okay? Duh. No, I got my tank top on. Here, you guys just want the gray tank top? All right. There you go. How's that? Is that better? Here. Is that better? <laughs> yeah, well, that's not fat. That's just... Well, it's a tight shirt. This is a small. So, it's like very tight on me. Very tight. Very tight. Nope. No bra. I, I have been blessed with small boobies. I don't need a bra. Well, depends on what I wear. Depending on the dress, then yes, I won't need a bra. But there's something for you guys to dream about. I don't wear a bra. <laughs> Smuggling peanuts. <laughs> yeah, I can't hide a credit card under these babies. Sorry, I mean. Here, wait, wait, wait. Here. Thank you. I got smalls. Well, that took forever. Want to become famous? Buy followers. Crimes and views on bigfollows.com. Hmm. Yeah, I'm at, you know what, Archie? You're probably right. That's probably how a lot of people do it. You know, they buy, they start buying, you know, kind of like telemarketers. They just buy a list. And you know what? That's cool. I understand that, but I'm, I don't have any money to do that. <laughs> I gotta have money first to do that. <laughs> oh, is it? All right. Well, I'll, I'll have to come back through and try and do it because, um, is that home? Um, yeah. Why do I have a mod then? No, but. Thank you, Archie. Thank you, bot, for that information. Thank you. No, I mean, it. that's how business works, man. I mean, seriously, if I want to have that 1,000 view mark, if I want to have that 75 view mark, that's probably going to be the easiest and best way to do it. But that becomes counterintuitive of what I'm trying to do is make money on this stream. Yes, you have to spend money to make money, but I'm not that fucking petty. Yeah. You know, I, I, I'm just not going to do it. Now, if somebody wants to some, do that for me, outstanding. If somebody just wants to load up my my subscriber follower or yeah, with a bunch of bots, I'm cool with that. Just don't have it be spamming my chat. That's all. <laughs> or if it's going to be a bot, let it be a friendly bot and that we can get along with it <laughs> and not be annoying. No, I, I've had the worst luck with bots. Well, okay, Jason or somebody, type in um, exclamation point address because we were having trouble again with that yesterday. So I don't know if that's working or uh, exclamation point donate. That goes to my uh, PayPal account. It worked. And again, thank you, Jay Hyde Ashbury, uh, last week for the five dono. That was awesome. Thank you. Um, and I think bits are working, but I don't know. They were, they were working. 
So if somebody wants to spend one bit for something just to make sure it's working, that'd be cool. I'd appreciate it. Because I just want to make sure my stuff's working. Hmm. Yeah. Um, it's, uh, it's Ruby Grapefruit. No, it's funny, I kind of have this weird face. You know, they always say that you have a good side, bad side. I definitely do. Or is it just the whole face? Well, I like the birthmark. Now I have a, I thought I had another one coming in right in here. I don't know. But definitely got that one right there, so. Wow, everybody jetted. All right. <laughs> Oh, uh, football must have just started. <laughs> That's usually what happens. It's usually what happens. All right, guys, let's finish this drink. And then we're going to head on upstairs. I'll probably play some GTA later tonight. Um, I have phantasmophobia. I just got to download it. Um, so I don't know if Andazan's going to be on tonight. I don't know. But yeah, phantasmophobia or phasmophobia. What the... Whatever the phobia it is, I did buy it. I just got to download it. Hi, CD. Hi, how are you doing? Doing good, doing good. It, it did freeze? Yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm sorry. I didn't know it froze. It didn't tell me anything. I'm sorry. Um, no, 